What is going on, guys? Ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, and it is King Steve Arias, guys, coming right back at you. And today, guys, we have a very interesting topic that I have been very much brought my attention to. We have talked about how Pulse has been buffed, and right now, a lot of consensus is saying that Pulse is too buffed, that he's too strong. So I'm going to go ahead and give you guys my thoughts on this overall arcing thing. So first of all, let's talk about what was buffed and uh, let's just, I'll just give you a lowdown of what was buffed. So Pulse used to be able to see people through with this cardiac radiator and what they basically did is they, they increased, they kind of made the look of the cardi cardiac uh, heartbeat sensor like look better and it, and now it picks up people way faster than it did before. I think it was like one point two sec it picked up someone every two seconds or something like that now it goes every half second so it sped it up extra mentally and right now i'm not even gonna lie guys right now he has been he has been a lot more prevalent than i have ever seen pulse like you 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 you're fighting for pulse like right now in lobbies that i get into i'm fighting to try to be pulse and it's really crazy like i never thought i would ever try to fight to be pulse but Man, we live in a, it's a very different world. This has very much changed the dynamic of the overall defensive operators and how the overall defensive play works now. I mean, you have, um, like I said, you have Valkyrie that is a very Intel um, overall sensitive operator, but you also have Pulse who now can feed your team information as well. And it's very interesting that now I'm calling out people with not only Valkyrie, but I'm also calling people out with uh, Pulse. And I don't know what to say, man. I think it's amazing. I think it's really cool how we have another operator now that can do this. Now, he is very good right now. I, I, I would be lying to you. I would be, I would be fish telling you if I said that he was not. Um, he's a very strong operator right now, and you need to be aware of this. You need to be aware of this. I a lot of people say this buff buffed him beyond where he was before, and I mean it's right. Like he got buffed, so he is way better than he was before. But in my opinion, I feel like there were some people that were really good with pulse before, um, but now, for, at least in my opinion, he's much easier to use. Okay, it took a lot of time and effort to play with pulse before. Okay, that that's what I'm gonna say because you had to wait people out. You thought you you would see a heartbeat sensor like once, and then that would be it. Like, but that one brief moment a second that would be enough for some people to be like, okay, I'm gonna throw a nitro cell here, get them underneath the floor. I'm gonna pop down here and get a couple of them. Like some people were so good with him that they. They were like that. They, they were already like that. Now I feel like it's much easier to pick this out, and it's much easier for people to play as him, um, if, if, if I'm making myself clear. So the buff helped everyone play as him as he should have been played to begin with. I think that's what I'm trying to get at. And do I think that he needs a nerf? Um, I don't know. I, I don't think so. I don't think so. I feel like he's okay the way he is now. Um... The, the thing that I've got to say that I think that Pulse is weak against, the, the one thing that I have to say that I think P Pulse is weakest against is shields. I feel like shields are his downside, okay? If you get a shield in front of him, because this is the thing. If you have, uh, let's say you have a, a wall right in front of you, okay, right? Right, you've got a wall in front of you, and and you know someone is there, right? You know that someone is on the other side of that, that, that barricaded uh, door, okay? You start shooting across, and it's a shield... Man, you're in for another treat. Now, you also have the Nitro Cell, which can counter that. I, I will give you that. You can do that. But, you know, you never know. Like, you might have already wasted it, or perhaps it's gone. Like, there's a lot of times that I waste my Nitro Cell. I ended up not killing anybody. And maybe that's just because I'm an idiot and I don't get it. But, like, sometimes you miss your Nitro Cell. And i got to tell you, when, when you're in that situation where you break down the door, and that's the other thing, you break down that door, and now you give the um, the shield away to shoot back at you, okay? And, I don't know, like, I feel, I don't know, I feel like Pulse is very, very good, don't get me wrong. But I do not know if he needs a nerf. I, I, I don't think I'd go that route. I think that he's pretty good as he is right now, and he's, he's, I don't think that they're going to nerf him. I really think that he's okay. I feel like, I don't feel like he needs a nerf. Um, you know, I... I mean, to be honest with you, if there was one thing that I would do, maybe this is just this is just a suggestion. This is just maybe something that I've thought of. 
is if they took his nitrous cell away. Now, I know some people are going to be pitchforking me out on this one because people love that nitrous cell. And yeah, you're right. That's great. But that would basically mean that shields are gonna shields are gonna dominate him, and that would give him a very big weakness. Okay, that would be a weak point because I don't know how they can really nerf his ability. I don't think they can. But if there was a nerf that I would give him, I would say, you know what, take the nitrous cell away and give him barbed wire. Okay, like that. That's what I would say. That's what they did to Frost, and it greatly nerfed Frost as well. Like Frost was a very big threat. I don't know if you guys remember, but she was a a massive threat. Just, I mean, she still is. She still is a massive threat. But like taking that nitrous cell away really made her vulnerable against shields. And uh, like I, you know, I think that this would do the same for. Uh, I think it would be very good for. Uh, um, I feel like it would be very good for a pulse as well. Wow, I can't. I can't talk right now. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I I feel like he's very good, but I don't feel like he needs to be nerfed. I feel like he's good as he is. And uh, I think that, this is what I think, I think that a lot of people are trying him out now, and a lot of people are really liking him, but, you know, people loved Pulse when he first came out too, and I think that he eventually will become an operator that not as many people play. I'm, you know, it's very weird because he's even being played in, in, uh, in, uh, in, in, in pro matches now. Which I never thought I would see. I never thought I would see Pulse played in, in ranked matches. But he is, and he's being played very highly. So, I mean, he is a very good operator. He is someone that you should fear. But uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Do you like what you saw here? Hit that like button, guys. And if you wouldn't mind hitting that subscribe button, man, it would just make my day. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. I hope to catch you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye, guys.